We used to call it connective tissue, which kind of diminished its capacity. But we now know today that it has a brain called an interstitium. And that interstitium has these sensory processing, called like nerve endings. <clears throat> and your, let's say your brain has a hundred billion of these sensory processing uh, cells, or let's say. And it's not directly a cell, but the fascia has a has hundred trillion. And <clears throat> the, so we, we have all these things, like the fascia is what it covers the organs is what we're told. And then it covers the muscles and nerves, the tendons of the glands and the brain. But to tell you the truth, we're actually born in fascia. So there's a ball of plasma when we're born. And inside that, in the first six weeks, there's these two nerve clusters that connect. And then after six weeks, the muscle skeletal system grows around that. That fluid is fascia. It's a plasma. And so interesting thing from a scientific point of view, the only thing you can cut everything out of the body, you can cut your eye, you cut teeth out, you know, in dissection, you can cut every bone, every nerve, every tendon, every organ out, but you can't remove fascia. So if you look at it from a more of a systems process is we are fascia and inside of it is all the things that we currently study around human health.